episode 5, we take the ferry from Craignure to Oban, then head northward to Loch Alsh, where we stay in a B&B for the night. So today we're going to travel back from the Isle of Mull to the mainland and then travel up a little further north up the coast. And we'll be catching the ferry from Craignure over to Oban and then driving up next to uh, Loch Linney up to Fort William and then from there over uh, following the line of the River Shiel to the Kyle of Loch Alsh and the town of Balmacara. Well we had a successful night camping last night no drama with the wind or the weather and now we're heading over to the ferry terminal which you can see ahead of us there which is really uh, right next to the campsite and we have a little time before the ferry so uh, we're going to go and sort out our tickets we have to change the time I think on our tickets but uh, the ferry is in about 45 minutes and I think it looks like there's only a couple of people ahead of us here in the line, so we'll probably be one of the first vehicles onto the boat this morning. Okay, there's our signal to drive onto the, onto the boat here. And uh, in case you're wondering, we did speed this part of the video up just to uh, <laughs> make it a little shorter. Because uh, you drive pretty slowly when you're driving onto the ferry. Okay, so the vehicle safe and sound onto the boat, and we're ready for the short crossing back to Oban. And we'll probably stop in Oban and get a quick bite to eat before we hit the road for the day. All right, so we arrived safely in Oban. And uh, in case you're wondering, we did speed this part of the video up to gonna head into town, find somewhere to park and get a bite to eat. And uh, then we'll hit the road, head up to Fort William and destinations beyond. After a tasty fish and chips and a delicious steak pie at the Oban Inn, we set off from Oban toward Fort William and then onward from there to the Kyle of Loch Alsh. Crossing the Connell Bridge here, which spans Loch Etiv, and it runs over the uh, Falls of Laura, which is a tidal race that forms a rapid underneath the bridge. go over this bridge in a moment.
crossing the Balakulish Bridge here, which is across the narrows between Loch Lian and Loch Linny. And we're just arriving in Fort William now. The rain's really coming down, so I don't think we're going to stop here. And uh, we'll just sort of continue on our way, try and get to our destination before it gets dark. But there's a large promenade here on uh, Loch Linney to our left. And of course, uh, Fort William is one of the largest towns, largest settlements in the area. And it's adjacent to Ben Nevis, which is the highest mountain peak in the UK. And those are the foothills ahead of us. The mountain is just beyond. Okay, so today our uh, ferry over to the Outer Hebrides, the island of Barra, was cancelled because of bad weather. I think we mentioned that. So we were trying to figure out what to do. And came back to the mainland, to uh, Oban. We decided to sort of rearrange the schedule. We we're going to go to the Outer Hebrides and then back to Sky. So instead, we're going to head up to Sky area today. Um, we have a uh, hotel booked tonight at Kyle Luck House, which is pretty close to Sky. We're going to camp there tonight, or not camp there tonight, but stay there tonight. Um, I think tomorrow we will go to Plockton, which is the town where uh, Hamish Macbeth was filmed. The TV show Hamish Macbeth with Robert Carlyle. So we're going to go and see that. Then we'll head over to Sky and spend a couple of days over there. Um, hopefully we'll find some good camping spots there. And uh, then we'll figure out probably going from Sky over to Tarbot on uh, Harris and Lewis and to get to the Outer Hebrides that way. So we have a little bit of rearranging to do with our tickets, but we'll sort that out when we get into the hotel today. We should have Wi Fi in the hotel, which uh, will be a bit more comfortable. and. Uh, and sit down and be able to use the laptop and stuff. But yeah, last night was good. We stayed in Craignia and we found a campsite right right next to the ferry terminal actually. We actually walked over last night to check it out. And so that was super convenient. So we um, packed up this morning and we're over at the ferry in line to get on the ferry at 10.30 a.m. Caught the 11 a.m. ferry over from Craignia back to Oban. Had some lunch at Oban, went to a little pub. I had some fish and chips. And Elspeth had a steak pie. And it was very good, good choice, Elspeth. Um, yeah, so on the way now to Cadillac Alch, as I said, tomorrow's sky. And we'll give you another update then. Driving here through Glen Shiel, and that's the River Shiel to the left of us. This is the road to Sky, and the scenery here is magnificent. It's just amazing, even in the rain. They do say that uh, Scotland looks its best when the weather is at its worst, and I think that might be true. So we have a little way down 
just a few miles to go. And um, the castle at Ellen Donnan is at the bottom of the hill. So we'll stop there and take a look around. And then it's not far from there to our final destination for today, which is the town of Balmakara on the Kyle of Loch Ausch. So here we are at Ellen Donnan Castle. We're uh, going to park up and take a few photographs. We'll see what kind of photos we can take in this light. Okay, here's our hotel coming up on the right, so arrived safely and in daylight, going to check into the hotel and uh, have a nice meal and get ready for tomorrow's trip to Sky and hopefully some good camping. If you enjoyed the video, please like, follow or subscribe depending on your social media of choice. Thanks so much for watching. See you next time.